Hello everyone, my name is Leonard Legin and this is my screencast for metabolism of paracetamol. Hope you all can learn something from my screencast. Basically, this is the structure of paracetamol, which have the acetyl group attached at this position or known as beta position. 90% of paracetamol will enter the body and get converted into sulfate conjugate via sulfation process and glucuronide conjugate via glucuronidation process. This sulfate conjugate are formed by the action of sulfur transferase on paracetamol molecule which lead which lead to conjugation of sulfate group at the paracetamol molecule while Glucuronidation are occur via the action of enzyme UDP glucuronide transferase, which attach the glucuronide or glucuronic acid into the paracetamol molecule. This both conjugation will help increase the hydroplicity of paracetamol. This will make paracetamol more soluble in water and easily eliminated from the body. While the other 5% will eliminated by the urine, while the other 5% will become toxic form of paracetamol, which is n acetyl parabenzoquinone imminens. This occur through the action of the cytochrome P550 monooxygenase system which is the component of phase 1 reaction. However, this n acetyl p benzoquinone aminin will combine immediately with glutathione to form non-toxic mercaptate conjugate, as you can see here, which can be eliminated from the body. That's all from me and thank you for watching.